Hi there, Dave here again, and today I'd like to show you what to do if you're having problems after not shutting your computer down properly. So just to clarify, to shut your computer down the correct way, you should let Windows do it for you. For example, you should click on Start, Shut Down, if you're using Windows 7 or Vista. If instead you just turn the power off, or if you had a power cut when your computer was on, you might find that now you have some corrupted files. Perhaps your computer now starts running a lot slower than normal, or maybe it starts acting a little strange. If you have this problem, then it's time to run Windows Error Checking Program. This guide is for Windows 7 and Vista users. So let's run it now. Click on Start Computer. Right click on the C drive and select Properties. Click on the Tools tab. Next to Error Checking, click on Check Now. Here, make sure Automatically Fix File System Errors has a tick next to it. The other box can be left blank. Then click on Start. Then click on Schedule Disk Check and restart your computer. Windows will now try to fix any corrupted files that you might have on your computer as it restarts. After that, Windows will start up as normal. The whole process can often take around 10 minutes, but this can vary depending on your computer and the amount of files you have on there. And that's it. You can run this program at any time. If you have other hard drives, if you'd like to, you can run this program for them as well, using the same method, only this time you probably won't need to restart your computer. As you'll see in a moment, Windows found errors on this hard drive and fixed them all. Well that's it for today, thanks for watching my video, see you next time.